everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So this is the April Fool's Day video. So the reason that we are looking at a unwrapped Easter egg wrap is because this is going to be part of my April Fool's joke. So since April Fool's has fallen on Easter, there has been videos going around of people putting like tomatoes in Easter wrappers. But my husband likes tomatoes and he doesn't like chocolate. So that wouldn't be... A trick at all he would be quite happy if he received a tomato instead of a chocolate egg so I decided that I would get one of these styrofoam Easter eggs that we painted the other day and I would wrap them up for April Fool's because let's face it nobody wants to receive a styrofoam Easter egg I mean how useless would that be so I'm not very good at wrapping up things so I have to make it look like it did in the beginning should be really hard oh dear <laughs> I'm just going to fix this up so there we go there's our easter egg now i know it's not the best wrapping job but it was the best i could do so this is my april fool's day joke now let's go and show it so i have little alexander here and he's going to give daddy his egg from the babies happy easter take the easter egg oh thank you thank you dearie it's from Alexander. Why well, has it been rewrapped? It hasn't been rewrapped. Oh, hasn't it? It's a chocolate Easter egg. Oh, it is, yeah. Cool. Mm, yeah. Happy April <laughs> Fool's! <laughs> As you've seen, our April Fool's Day prank did not go very well at all. He actually took a bite out of it. You can see the bite marks there. <laughs> Well, he didn't take a bite out of it, but he bit it as like just a joke. But ah, uh, we didn't trick him. I'm so bad at doing pranks. Um, let me know in the comments below if you have an April Fool's Day prank idea that I could try next year so that I can practice and next year I will get him for sure. So let me know in the comments below what pranks you would suggest me to do next year. So just before I go, I just want to update you guys on a few little things. So the first thing is I have some guests coming to stay at my house this week and they're staying in the nursery, hence why there's no teddy bears in the backgrounds like there normally is. Um, so because we need to use the nursery, I won't be able to film in here and I probably won't be doing um, very long videos. And then in a fortnight's time, the videos will become short again because I'm going down to see my parents. So last time I went down to see my parents, I recorded on the day and I put them up on the day. But because my parents have such bad internet, I'm going to make the videos short so they're not going to take all day to upload. Um, and also... I'm going to pre-record them so I can enjoy spending the week with my family because that week is going to go very quickly because as you guys know, we live in different states so it's a little bit hard. So that is what is going to be happening over the next few weeks. Um, also letting you guys know that I also have another YouTube channel. Now this YouTube channel is for my fertility stuff and reborns and my other YouTube channel, I'll link it in the description below. It's called Guardian Spirit and it's more about um, religion and the Bible. So if you are interested in religion, you can go to my YouTube channel and check it out. And as always, please like and subscribe. So thank you so much for watching our April Fool's Day video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, even though it was a complete fail. I'm really sorry about that. Um, and don't forget to let me know in the comments below what I should do next year. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Over to you, Eva. Give me thumbs up. Black guy.